My name is Joyce Marina and I became involved with BTW sometime in the 70s. My husband, who's now deceased, he thought it was a good idea for me to get involved with something theatrical. He always thought that I was a drama queen. The early days of Black Theatre Workshop were particularly interesting. Um, it was hard, but it was, we had a, a, a group of people who were dedicated, but it was very difficult because we never had money. But we were always wanting to do the work that the theater um, called for. But it was a nice group of people who were right into it. Despite all the difficulties, we were going to keep the theater. I was on the board as an ordinary member, and then I made the mistake of becoming the secretary. Oh, that was a lot of work. But I enjoyed the board because it was a small board, and we did more work than talk. You know, there are big boards that everybody just, yeah, but we did a lot of work. Small board, we did a lot of work, and we really believed. I think what carried us through is that we believed in the cause. We really believed in the cause. And of course, with Clarence and Winston, how, how could you forget? You know, but it was good days, good days. Oh, it was nice to dress up. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, I wasn't taking an active role in the uh, vision celebration as I do now. You know, I just paid my money, came and sat down, had a good time. We a boogie on the floor, got dressed up nicely, meet a few folks, and that was nice. But of course, vision then and vision now are two different visions. That was small and kind of contained. But this, this vision that you people do now, this, this is a real vision. Oh, yeah, for sure. So you, you can always compare the first vision to what we're doing now. There's definitely a comparison there. Because it's small, small stuff, you know. Now we enter, we enter a rest, not a restaurant, but into a hotel and you have all this stuff. Now we went into all that. We just got a haul and do our stuff. Play that was written by it's Leonton Martin's play, and Wendy Davidson and Winston. Winston was our artistic director at the time, and he that was a play that Leon wrote centered around Christmas. It was really telling you how people in the islands celebrate Christmas as opposed to people here. I mean, my first Christmas here, I was still married to Ken. I said, where, where are the folks? Why are they not coming? Because you're accustomed having people knocking on the door, you know, and you just put the spread out. The, the food is always there, all the delicacies there, and you clean up that mess, and then the second lot came, and, and you sort of expected that. Here you have to find out, could I come across to you? I wasn't used to that. It took me a long time to get used to that. So Christmas and Cars really showed us how you, 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 you are in the house cleaning it up, and you're putting up the curtain, and when, the, when it was Wendy's house, and um, I was the new woman in the village, and I had a son, and somebody interfered in my child, and I went totally bonkers. And so I come in and I'm knocking out the door, and I'm really angry. But you smell the, 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 the baking, the food that is cooking, the ham, um, uh, the cake that is, is a regular fruit cake that you must have at Christmas. There are certain drinks you must have in the house, like sorrel and all that sort of stuff, and it's rum and coke, and you know, it's really, really nice. And then I get into this, 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 I'm so angry, and I come knocking at the door to find, well, who's the fan of my kid? And that's when I met Wendy. Early days were hard days. But it was good, it was good, because we believed in what we were doing. I love that. I kind of missed those hard days, but good, it was good, very good. Uh, uh, for, for me, a person who is not involved, in my profession is, I'm a nurse. So I had nothing to do with theater, so coming into there, I say, oh my God, what is this? This is a whole different arena for Joyce. But then I became, re and because of Ken, Mike, my, my Ken, he used to tell me, and Ken likes theater himself because he did a better acting too. He used to say, you got to go to there, the meetings are so long. He said, no, you have to go, you have to go. And I learned a lot about all the, all the different uh, people that you have to, write these damn letters to, oh, don't put that in, these damn letters to, to get some money. They need to know, they want your whole damn history to get some money. And I didn't like that part. But other than that, I thought it was wonderful. I, I mean, 
I will always love Black Theatre Workshop. Always. It is my, when it comes out there, nobody can't say anything about Black Theatre Workshop. Don't you dare say anything about Black Theatre Workshop, you're gonna deal with me. That's how much I love Black Theatre Workshop. Love it.